In this short video, I'm going to share with you the five habit areas in business that have allowed me to create my true livelihood and that also help my clients uh, organize their projects and priorities and tasks in their business to create and improve upon their existing business. And as you listen to the over these five areas, I encourage you to think about, um, sense into what is calling to you. What tasks, what projects, what habits are calling to you uh, to, to be done, to be created, to be installed in your business and your life so that you can have an ideal business, a true livelihood. In the next video, I'll actually share with you some specifics of the tasks and habits that, uh, that I do and that I encourage my clients to do. But uh, I first want you to think about what's most true for you. I don't want to bias you. So I want you to write down, or at least think about, as you watch this first video, what's calling to you, what's most true for you, okay? Um, and so the first uh, habit area in business is enrollment. And enrollment basically is the set of activities where you are creating and improving your offering to the world. Uh, your service in the market, your product or your programs. And enrollment also includes the actual uh, outreach to uh, announce your services to the people who actually need it. And this includes, oh, also it includes pricing. I forgot to mention that. It also includes um, uh, referral partners and clarifying your referral network. So that's enrollment. The second habit area is content. Content is the set of activities where you are uh, practicing uh, your authentic voice in sharing your knowledge with the world, your experience, your life experience, uh, especially your expertise in your business, and just also your presence. So you're practicing your authentic presence, uh, and at the same time, you are serving the world, okay, and then you are drawing to you your ideal tribe. So that's the second habit area. The third habit area is service improvement. Service improvement is the set of activities where you are improving the effectiveness of your services to your clients and also the, the, the delight that your clients have as they experience you and your service. The most authentic way to market your business is to not have to market your business because your services are so wonderful, so delightful and effective to your clients that they naturally want to spread the word. And so that is what service improvement, this third habit area is all about. Uh, the fourth habit area is joyful productivity because to create and sustain a wonderful business requires you to have a set of skills that allow you to work efficiently, effectively and and ideally also joyfully throughout the whole day, throughout every day as you work, right? So that joyful productivity is the set of those activities, including things like time management, information organization, um, things like that. And then uh, finally, the fifth habit area is healthy money. Because if you know how to make money, but you don't know how to save your money so that you can truly achieve your life priorities and to have a feeling of financial security, then it's it's for nothing. And so it's really about a healthy relationship with your money. So that's a fifth habit area. So as you listen to these, enrollment, content, service improvement, joyful productivity, and healthy money, what is calling out to you? So write out any specifics that call out to you. Things that you want to get done, habits you want to install, projects you want to complete in your business. Write those down. And in the next video, I'll give you some more specifics so that if you write down yours first, you'll learn more deeply as you listen to the next video or watch the next video. So I hope that's helpful. I'm always open to your questions. And um, until the next video, I wish you well.